What's going on, guys? Uh, it's been a while. Uh, just been getting some things done. Uh, just hadn't had much work here lately. We've kind of been in a drought. Um, I'm out here actually about to clean my grill up. I have some meatloaf on the grill tonight. But, uh, like I said, we've been in a good sized drought here lately. So, a lot of people have actually, you know, just said, hold off on the yard. Uh, I'll call you when, you know, we're ready to cut. Uh, so next week I got some pretty good sized jobs to do. I'm gonna get some good mowing footage and some hedge trimming footage for you. Also some edging too. I got to do some hard edging. Uh, one of my customers, he's selling his property and uh, needs some, needs, you know, make it look good to, for the real, the, I guess you'd consider a real estate company to come through and be able to sell it, you know, then there's some pretty good pictures. Um, but to show you the, uh, drought we've been having, normally within a week, my grass is real tall, at least say six to eight inches already. Uh, but I hadn't cut my grass in four weeks, and I'm about to show you what it looks like. Alright, this is four weeks. So I'll dry and just normally. If I waited four weeks, this would be way past my ankles. A week would be past my ankles. But yet, it's that low. So, as you see there, it's pretty much uh, dying unless we get some rain coming in. We had some the other day, but you know, we need more. And these 100 degree temperatures are just drying everything out. Right before our rain yesterday, we only had a few showers. And before that, you'd walk on the grass and it sounded like you're walking on snow. It crunched so much. Uh, but I appreciate you guys support um been talking to DLT and a few others you know about some issues we've been having mostly Doc though he's been helping me a lot and I appreciate that Doc um your input has been a good motivation and uh it's helping me along uh Give me some actual headway on which directions I need to go. I appreciate that. But guys, this ain't much. Uh, my birthday was the other day. My mom's birthday's tomorrow. And then I'm going to be cooking a big hash up for July the 4th. Uh, but today, meatloaf's on the menu. So I got to get busy cleaning this old trawl barrel up and getting it ready to fire up once Rhonda gets back home. But uh, guys, we thank y'all. We love y'all. And y'all stay safe in this crazy world. And God bless all of you.